Hi, did you just get a premium starter kit like this from Young Living? Or have you wondered about it? Or maybe you need a refresher. This video is for you. I'm really excited to share what's in the premium starter kit and some practical ways to build wellness and health in your family with these 12 oils. So what's in a starter kit? If you don't know, you get a beautiful box of 12 oils. You get a diffuser. My favorite is the Desert Mist. I'll show you in a minute how to use it. And then you get um, a product guide. I'm getting it out of my box here. The pro oops, product guide to show you all the different, over 600 different non-toxic products Young Living has and a magazine. Okay, this is an amazing deal too. It is way over 50% retail price. Um, all these things I'm gonna show you are um, valued at over $400. And a starter kit is only $165. Young Living really wants you to get started and has put together the best way to. So let's start it. Let's get going. All right, so you have your essential oils. How do you use it? Well, first of all, there are three ways to use oils. Aromatically, topically, and internally. So aromatically, the easiest way is to diffuse. Besides opening up a bottle and just smelling it, it's getting in your system and you're gaining benefits from just doing that. But continually using it with a diffuser. So let's talk about a diffuser. How do you use it? First, take off the inner lid and you're gonna fill water up to that ridge. And then put in your drops of oil, maybe three to eight. The a great thing to do is to go low and slow when you're first starting with essential oils, okay? So that means lower amount of drops um, and just see how you feel or how strong it is or if you could smell it in your open space or smaller space. Um, and then you could build on from there. And low means maybe start with applying it lower on your body like an unsensitive area like your feet. Okay, back to diffusing. So fill it up, put in your drops, put in on the inner lid, make sure it goes in the little ridge there, and then put on the pretty outer lid. Then there are two buttons on your diffuser, um, a circle and a light bulb. So the circle's the power. So one would be strong, two, medium, three touches of the button, and that would be intermittent, and it would go on a minute, off a minute. And that way would be uh, last the longest, up to 10 hours. So that could be a great setting for sleeping. Then the light bulb bu button goes through different colors. My favorite is the candle flicker. You do not want candles in your home. That's why we have a diffuser and essential oils. And here are some of the mini colors. I think there's 11 choices and off. I put this, this diffuser actually goes by my bedside table and it's on the off position for sleeping. Okay, so that's aromatic. Topically, I use, you could put oils just on your body, wherever the need is. And like I said, the feet are a great place. Your pores are very large there and they, the oils can absorb easier and it's not a sensitive area. Or maybe you don't like the smell or you're not sure. So your feet are a great place. Um, what I also like to do is make roller balls. Some oils need to be diluted when you put it on topically. That means using a carrier oil. My favorite is fractionated coconut oil. Um, it's always liquid, liquid and it doesn't have a scent and it has a long um, shelf life. But there are many different carrier oils. Even what you have to cook with, like olive oil, would work just fine. So diluting helps when you have a hot oil like peppermint not give you any sensitivity to your skin. And it's ready to go if it's in a roller ball. So I add maybe 10 to 20 drops of an essential oil and fill the rest with um, the carrier oil, put the roller lid on, and then roll on. This is actually my energy wake up blend. You see where I'm putting it topically? And I keep a lot of these roller balls in my purse. And by the way, that's peppermint and lemon. Okay, and finally, the third way to use oils is internally. You can internally use oils that have a white label in Young Living's Vitality line. 
and I'll talk about that later. A few ways that I use oils internally is I put a drop in my coffee or smoothie, I make lavender lemonade, I cook with it, but then also I use vegetable capsules and I st with essential oils in it and I swallow it for um, internal, internally for um, different wellness reasons. Okay, let's open up our oil box and talk about the oils now. Um, so you open up the beautiful lavender cover. Okay, and you have this box here. All right, on the side with the lavender fields, there is a little pouch with some literature. So this is helpful. This kind of goes over the lifestyle of Young Living and the, the great product um, opportunities you could buy. And then this little pamphlet shows you uses for each of your oils. So I'm gonna use this to even talk about some uses today and add my own as well. Okay, so when we first take this up, you have your oils right here and it's a nice uh, display case like this and you can put it on your counter. Now, the thing with essential oils is results come from consistently using them. So put them where you will consistently use them and see them um, on the kitchen, in your bathroom. All right, so let's start. Oh, before I go, go begin with the uses, there is a second layer, don't forget that. And underneath are lots of goodies, two extra oils, cause there's 10 here and some other products. So we'll talk about that in a couple minutes. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly give you some practical uses for these everyday oils. So let's start with lavender. Everyone's heard of lavender and I love it. Young Living Lavender is so gentle and pure and it could even be great for babies. Um, lavender does not need to be diluted with the carrier oil. It's so gentle, it can go right on your skin. There's um, so many uses. I'm not gonna tell them all today, but um, lavender is called the Swiss Army Knife because whatever you're going through, grab that lavender and it probably will help. But a couple specific uses, cuts, burns, scrapes, any skin issues, itchiness, bug bites, um, put on some lavender and it will soothe it. It's great for your hair. Put a few drops in your shampoo or mascara tube to strengthen and um, make the life um, longer of your mascara. I'm looking at my little cheat sheet here. Oh, you know, when you think of lavender, you think of calming, de-stressing. It's great to diffuse it at bedtime. And take a smell of lavender and it's great for uh, just calming you down. So skin, hair, calming, that's lavender. And it is a vitality oil, even though this is a color label, it comes in two. I like, like I said, to make lavender lemonade or even lavender brownies by adding about four drops or five drops in the uh, your brownie mix. Okay, frankincense. If it's good enough for Jesus, it's definitely good enough for me and you, right? Frankincense is a prized oil. It is wonderful for grounding and focus and calming down. Right now, before I did this video, I put a drop on my head and I'm like my head, a natural diffuser. I feel calm and collected. If you do yoga, frankincense would be great to diffuse. If you read the Bible and have Bible study, you meditate, put in, um, have some frankincense on or diffuse it. Um, frankincense is great for your skin, great for um, keeping you look young. I put some topically, you could put it directly on your skin right here and right here at bedtime. A lot of times I put a drop in my night um, moisturizer or morning. So frankincense is amazing. One other thing, there are so many, many reasons it is so powerful and such a great healer. Scars, sunspots um, is also, can, this can be helpful. It's also great for immune support. You could take that internally. Okay, let's talk about a blend called Citrus Fresh, the happy oil. It's very freshening, it um, uplifts, so I love diffusing this. Maybe even after school and we're doing homework, helps a little bit with focus and awakening. Um, anything stinky, citrus fresh is your friend. 
put a drop on cotton ball and stick it in stinky shoes in your trash um, or just diffuse. Um, you can use this internally and it has great immune boosting support and antioxidants. Um, I put a drop in my smoothie or iced tea for some examples. Um, oh, I love to use it for laundry. I put a drop on my dryer balls and the laundry smells great. And I has, have also made a freshen up spray or like a poopery spray for the bathroom. About 10 to 15 drops of citrus fresh in water and in my spray bottle. Yay for citrus fresh. Okay, next I'm gonna talk about Digize. Digize is all about digestion. It is a blend of tarragon and peppermint and juniper and fennel, patchouli. It has a very strong scent, so you probably don't want to diffuse it, but it works almost imme immediately for any tummy troubles, bloating, gas, um, pain, rub some on. Um, if you have sensitive skin, maybe put a little bit of the carrier oil first in your hand and then a couple drops and then rub it on your tummy. It's also very effective if you take it internally. It's um, put a couple drops in juice and drink it down or make it into a capsule. Um, this is, has been an amazing thing. Um, I always keep my little roller ball of Digize with me in my purse just in case. I don't want to be without a Digize. Yay, Digize. Okay, um, now let's talk about Thieves. Thieves is, I can't live without this either, a wonderful immune support. It has a blend of um, cinnamon, clove, rosemary, lemon, and eucalyptus. It's wonderful to diffuse and it smells like fall. Um, and because of that cinnamon and clove, it tastes really good too. So I add this to my morning coffee kind of as, um, flavor booster and immune support. We put this on our spine and feet daily before bed or going to school, especially around being around um, lots of kids or people um, or around sick people. We don't wanna get sick or put it on um, if we are sick to get over it faster. Because there's cinnamon in here, that's a hot oil, you do need to dilute this. So making a roller ball um, with a carrier oil is a good idea. Sometimes if you don't have a roller ball, I just uh, put use a little bowl and my fractionated coconut oil and several drops of these and then rub it on. Easy as that. Um, this is also good in applesauce, yogurt, and um, oatmeal. Um, and you get that immune support. Um, yes. Let's talk now about lemon. Oh my goodness. Lemon is a wonderful oil for um, cutting grease and it's great for cleaning. Um, it takes away paint, um, permanent marker from the walls or spots like that. Um, it takes off stickers. Don't use that gooby gone with all the chemicals. Use lemon. Lemon is also really uplifting and um, happy. I'm diffusing it right now. A great one. I always put a drop in my water for the um, also support. Um, peppermint. I can't go without peppermint. All of these I can't go without. Peppermint is good for digestion. It also curbs your appetite. I make a tall glass of peppermint water, just one drop. It's strong. And after um, dinner, it helps um, me di my stomach digests better, but also helps me not want to eat more sweets or snack later on. It's good for head tension, for tummies, for um, in the car and curvy roads. You can make peppermint brownies or peppermint mocha, but peppermint's great for opening up the airways, also for um, energy, working out. You do need to use a carrier oil with this because it is a hot oil. Okay, and Raven, great for the airways as well. Raven is a wonderful blend with peppermint, wintergreen, lemon. It's like a spa. Um, where did I put it? I like to use, I put my bath salts somewhere. Make bath salts with this. Get a half cup bath salts and, or one to, or a cup, and maybe like eight drops of this, and then put it in your bath. Oh, it's like a spa. Um, 
I like to make a chest rub. If anyone is congested, we make a chest rub and put some on our feet and behind um, our back as well. Raven is um, great for exercise as well. Okay. And oh, one of my favorites is Valor. Valor is courage in a bottle. It's like, I can do this. Actually, tonight I'm gonna be speaking in the front of some people almost 150, 175 people, and I am gonna be using this. Um, what I've done is, I wear it like a perfume. In the bottom of your kit, you get two of these little rollerball tops. And you can take off the top of the plastic top on here. Let me show you what I already did. Oops. And insert the roller ball so you can just put it on right away mmm oh it's very sweet scent it just makes me happy but I call it that I can do it we bring it to when we're scared to do something go to the dentist or doctor or give a speech or presentation or a little scared it's um, we use valor it's also great for your skeletal system and sore muscles it's the courage and I can do it um, all right I think I talked about all these 10. Now I'm going to talk about what's underneath. Oh no, I didn't talk about pan away. Pan away is like pain away. It kind of smells like, kind of like Bengay a little bit. Oh, but it has a wonderful wintergreen smell to it and refreshing. Pan away can also help head tension, but whenever you have pain, this does need a carrier oil. Um, we use it in our family for growing pains or any soreness and um, muscle aches after working out. Um, one thing you can do because of that wintergreen, it smells kind of like root beer, mix this and stress away. I'll talk about that blend in a second. That smells like root beer float. Delicious. Okay, underneath your the second layer of your kit are two more oils that are must-haves. Do not leave these at home. Stress away. It does just that. It's a blend of lemon and, um, not lemon, sorry, lime and vanilla. It smells like a tropical paradise. And if you're stressed, driving in traffic, teens, fighting, um, work stress, this is one. I also use my roller top for this one. And I put this on ugh, regularly. It's always near me. I love stress away. It's also good for sleeping. So that's when I diffuse sometimes with lavender to let me relax and go to sleep. Lastly, a favorite in our, in our house is peace and calming. It just does that. It calms, it gives you peace when you're scared, anxious, and great for bedtime. Put it on your little toddler's feet before a nap. I diffuse this mm, half hour before bed to calm down my daughters and they sleep with this at night in their diffuser. Wow, so those are our 12 everyday oils. Remember, consistency is key. Um, three last things in your kit. The amazing antioxidant drink, Ningxia Red. It's made, it's very delicious. It's made out of wolf berries, which are like goji berries. It's very uh, high in antioxidants. If you don't take any supplement at all, this is the one to take. It covers all bases. You also get um, a Thieves um, spray. It's a healthy spray to kill germs. It's my shopping companion. Um, I spray it on the shopping carts or take it to restaurants, the counters, or anything that you need to disinfect. And then Thieves hand sanitizer. So on the go, um, healthy way to use that. So. That's your starter kit. I hope that gave you some ideas and please let me know if you have any questions and I will answer them. You have a blessed day and use your oils for health and wellness.